four years old when we first walked on the moon, and my parents did get me up for that, and that probably planted the seed, and then having the Johnson Space Center here in my backyard the whole time, I was always aware that what we're doing in the space program, and so ever since then, I just sort of uh, wanted to do it and kept pursuing that goal. I went to Parker Elementary, Johnston Junior High, and Westbury Senior High. Beautiful, just beautiful. I had very uh, interesting and engaging teachers that um, had high expectations and so I think it's it's kind of the combination of, of them being tough teachers and me having the drive to meet their expectations. I got to the final interview stages five times over a period of 14 years before I was finally selected. It was incredible. I was, needless to say, over the moon. <laughs> A few months later, I started training, and once we get through that, then we're deemed eligible for spaceflight. I was trained as the co-pilot on the Russian Soyuz spacecraft, so I did not fly to the station or from the space station on the American space shuttle. I flew on a Russian spacecraft. Launch and entry are pretty amazing times. I could tell as we were lifting off the launch pad and the whole thing is shaking, that everything was going fine. I never imagined when I was younger that I'd be trained as a cosmonaut. The first time in space was actually a very long flight. I spent six months aboard the International Space Station. You do not see borders from space, so it's hard to understand some of the disagreements that we have between countries. And the other thing that really strikes you from space is how thin the atmosphere is, and it really drives home how fragile the Earth is and that we absolutely have to take care of it. It's hard to describe just what that feels like. <laughs> the Soyuz landed on its side. This is typical. I want kids to know that if you have big dreams and you work hard, you can accomplish just about anything. We want kids to want to be astronauts because we want the best and the brightest to come work at NASA. My name is Shannon Walker, NASA astronaut, and I am HISD.